Is St. Louis City SE the greatest expansion team we've seen in MLS history? Hey everyone, welcome back to MLS Moves. Please make sure you like this video down below and subscribe to the channel if you are new. In the records of soccer history, 2023 is poised to be remembered as a year of revolution, especially in the United States. The debut of St. Louis City SC in Major League Soccer was not just a mere addition to the league. It was a beacon of exceptional talent, a testament to St. Louis's deep-rooted soccer culture, and an embodiment of dreams turned reality. Reality. Their on-field prowess is not mere luck, but a result of dedication, strategy, and a love affair with soccer that dates back decades. The soccer saga of St. Louis began in the early 20th century. Over the years, despite the ebb and flow of various teams, the essence of soccer remained. Even when teams like AC St. Louis and St. Louis Athletica faced challenges, the city's love for soccer remained robust. Discussions dating back to 2014 around a new soccer stadium rekindled hopes. Though the relocation of the Rams to Los Angeles in 2016 initially seemed like a setback, it actually reignited the soccer flame in the city. A potential downtown stadium was on the horizon in 2017, but the financial puzzle had yet to be solved. What makes St. Louis City SC's narrative special is its tale of resurgence. Under Carolyn Kendall Betts' dynamic leadership with ties to the iconic Enterprise rental car dynasty and female members of the Taylor family, St. Louis City is the first female majority owned team in MLS. Their journey filled with perseverance and vision finally passed paid off in 2019 when the city was awarded the 29th MLS franchise. The next feat was the construction of a staggering $450 million downtown stadium financed independently. The demand for season tickets, which skyrocketed, was a tangible metric of the public's anticipation. When 2023 rolled around, St. Louis City SC didn't tiptoe into the league, they thundered in, securing a victory against Austin FC right off the bat. Coach Bradley Carnell's nuanced strategies became the team's cornerstone, fueling their consistent performance throughout the season. Not even a household name like Miguel Amiron or Carlos Vela could have accomplished what they have in their expansion seasons. Rather, City's season has been more team-oriented. In the league, the squad has the second lowest payroll. Not that there aren't any stars, mind you. Roman Berkey in particular not only established himself as a formidable force in goal, but also became a central figure in MVP discussions due to his exceptional season-long performance. The team's two designated players, Edward Lowen and Zhao Klaus, have also made key contributions to the team. With 10 goals apiece, Klaus and American Nicholas Giochini are tied for the team lead. Lowen is tied for third in MLS with 14 assists. Their debut wasn't just noted, it resonated throughout the soccer community. St. Louis City SC became the talk of the town. The combination of Coach Carnell's tactics and the relentless energy of the team made him the favorite to win the Ziggy Schmidt MLS Coach of the Year award. This is what the St. Louis City SC manager had to say about their inaugural season quote in that first game we go up we go down we come back and then we win the game 3-2 with a late winner so from that moment we created sort of a monster a snowballing monster that just got bigger we go 5-0 and and it becomes a fairy tale season from the very early days and then to maintain that was obviously a big challenge am i surprised I'm just grateful for the boys that they have accepted the culture the identity and the intensity that we play at and you know we're still not done yet." End quote. Their remarkable tally of 17 debut win seasons shattered records, drawing attention from every corner of the sports world. The accolades didn't stop there. By seizing the regular season conference title, they further staked their claims as a powerhouse. Comparisons began to emerge, likening their debut iconic inaugural seasons across various sports. St. Louis City's influence sent shockwaves beyond just the soccer pitch. Their essence became an integral part of the community. Through various community engagements, partnerships, philanthropic endeavors, the club showcased its allegiance to its roots. Their endeavors aim not just at celebrating soccer, but at also making it inclusive and accessible. As the regular season culminated and playoff fever took over, expectations from St. Louis City skyrocketed. Under the meticulous guidance of Coach Carnell, they are not seen just as contenders, but as potential champions. Their anticipated face-off against the veteran Seattle Sounders is eagerly awaited by fans and analysts alike. St. Louis City's inaugural run in MLS isn't merely a commendable beginning. It's a stuff of legends. In history, their journey marked by the sheer skill on the pitch, passionate fan support, unwavering management commitment, hints at a bright future. Their story from inception to triumphant rise serves as an archetype for budding clubs and is a testament to passion, resilience, and the magic that ensues when both converge. As 2023 unravels, this chapter rich in triumphs and milestones will undoubtedly be recounted for ages to come. Thank you so much for watching. Please let me know down in the comment section if you believe that St. Louis City SC is the 
the best expansion club in MLS history. And if not, let me know who you think it is. And until next time, I will see you guys soon.